Baseball News Club highlights from Wednesday, August 19th. Randall Grichet for the Toronto Blue Jays cooled off the Baltimore Orioles. He hit two home runs for a much-needed win. And then Brad Keller, six and two-thirds innings pitch. Zero earned runs against the first game of two against Cincinnati for a win. And then Chicago, David Bodie, go-ahead hit, scoring two runs on a bases-loaded single. Cubs win. Cubs win. And then New York Yankees bullpen fails to Tampa Bay in the top eighth with two base hits scoring. Question to Yankee fans, please comment. Is it time to press the panic button? No Stanton, no Judge, no DJ. And then Trevor Bauer continues to be the hottest pitcher in baseball and dominating. Complete game, second shutout of the year, 9Ks. Absolutely in fuego. He's so hot. And then to go even crazier, he's 3-0, .68 ERA with a .57 whip. The dude is just straight up throwing BBs. And then Aaron Chevelle in Cleveland. Great pitch game. Complete game win over Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh's done. They've been done for a while, but great pitching performance. And then Mets pitching and clutch hitting. Jacob DeGrom just dominant. Six innings pitch, seven Ks. And then Michael Conforto. It's a go-ahead two-run HR for the Mets win. And the Chicago White Sox continue to be a playoff team with two HRs in the eighth inning, one by Abreu and the other one by Edwin and Canarcion. Now, question for Chicago White Sox fans. Can you please explain to me in the comments what the parrot means? And then in Milwaukee, hopefully this guy continues to get hot because Milwaukee needs him. Christian Yelich, boom. Home run puts Milwaukee on top for the win. Now for the best highlight of the day. Remember the other day when uh, Texas Rangers threw at Manny Machado after Tatis's unwritten rule grand slam? There you go. Payback. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. Manny Machado. Walk off Grand Slam. And the odd thing is, there's nothing in the news about how Manny stared down that Grand Slam. So, again, unwritten rules applied when and where they please.